This playlist is a unique Motorfest experience. It's called Made in Japan. Japanese car culture. It's where tarmac meets tradition. From mountain peaks to city streets, this neon journey is not one to miss. playlist out for you is what I call a perk of the job. Right in the center of all the action, racing these Japanese drift masters, just awesome. into the wild. Driving off-road gives you an opportunity to carve your own path, to explore the open expanse. Island becomes your playground. Total freedom becomes your creed. chance to go off the beaten path. But the next playlist is all about the competition. <laughs> Aptly named the Motorsports Playlist, this one is for the pros. Sports is built around racing to the top, the thrill of competing, 
But it's also about strategic choices, decision-making under pressure. feeling than triumphing with your team in what some consider the apex of motorsports. to go for the pit stop, checking on your rivals, it gets intense. <laughs> Felt good to be the champion, but then I got to go old school. Vintage garage. A playlist for the true car aficionado. With these cars, it's not just about the look or the nostalgia. It's how these things drive how they feel, how they steer. It was quite a challenge, in the best way possible. Outside of some collector car park, when would you ever get a chance to take these venerable legends for a spin? That's the power of Vintage Garage. taste of an age where there was no nitro to boost you and no GPS to guide you. It feels strangely comforting. With the old and in with the new, they say, the next playlist is legendary. Lamborghini. A playlist to truly experience the iconic, the trailblazing. I'm running out of adjectives here. that Lamborghini logo, you knew what this playlist was going to be. Some of the most recognizable car designs in existence at your disposal. through the story of Lamborghini, one of power and innovation. Riding the full roster of these legends was a rare privilege. A privilege Motofest 
graciously gave me. And now, it's your turn. what you saw well those were just the tip of the iceberg but we've got to go step by step follow me look around you this is what it's all about cars bikes rides and good vibes you'll get to explore the festival soon enough and let's not forget we're in hawaii and there's no better place to express yourself. Show off your flair. Customize your ride. It's a car culture buffet. Keep up. We're going to go meet the star of the show. Your car, of course. Come on. It's time for you to pick your ride. A playlist is ready to try. Let's go try it. We put this playlist together to give you a taste of Japanese racing culture. you discover almost everything the Japanese drivers have to offer.
another activity awaits. There's a special gathering tonight at the Japanese temple. The start of a whole new experience. Here's what to expect when getting there. A traditional Japanese summer vibe and lots of Kyusha cars. Meaning iconic, classic and made in Japan. On top of this, expect some exciting encounters. Motorfest has got some killer people to introduce you to an authentic Japanese racing experience. Don't worry, you'll meet them soon enough. So you had to wait, kid. Want to show us what you can do? Try this guy then. some proper Japanese street racing. Let's show them, guys. Gotcha. Got it. Sure, why not? Motorfest asked us to show you how it's done, but we don't do free tours here. You gotta play your part and give us a bit of a challenge. No pressure at all. Yeah, don't scare the kid, brother. Are you familiar with the Honda you're driving? The MSX is in your regular streetcar. It was made back in the 90s to stand neck and neck with the likes of Ferrari and Porsche. You sound just like Shingo. about Shingo, you know that if a rookie beats us with his NSX, we won't hear the end of it, right? I don't even want to think about giving Shingo the satisfaction. Better focus and win this thing, then. NSX stands for? New Sports Car Experimental. I wasn't asking you, Hina.
festival mood, they said. Feels just like our own traditional festival back home. on this very road. Even notorious racing groups like the Midnight Club cut their teeth here. And that's what slightly inspired our next event. Sharia with my NSX. Got me interested. Well, then I believe you're in for a treat. Oh, yeah? Well, bring it on. The show continues, kid. But watch out. You're driving Ren's Skyline this time, and there's no word to tell you how crazy she is about that car. Can't blame her. The R34 is a legend. It's a kaiju. car that takes skill to control. Yep. Ren spent years taming that beast. That car got nicknamed Godzilla for a reason. So basically, you crash Ren's car, better leave the planet. You're a fighter. Perfect to get a taste of the Wangen spirit. An absolute myth among Japanese street racers. Yeah, picture the Tokyo Bayshore route with one thing in mind, never slowing down. Race, you gotta go fast, friend. Well, guys, I don't think it's gonna be a problem. This is the skyline we're talking about. Deep breath. Don't lose control. He's 
dragons are massive. You got a wish to make? Sharp turn. Careful. Shingo missed a turn during a midnight race, supposedly because he was dazzled by the moonlight. Oh, shut up! I remember that. 